I'm actually I made the I made the good luck Teddy and Charlie videos um like three years two two three years ago not sure anymore and since like half of you didn't see my first video I posted it I would do another one because like the comments are just really annoying me they don't hurt but they're just annoying now so I'm just gonna go over a couple of things first of all it's supposed to be fake I don't understand how you can't understand that it's supposed to be fake. I saw all four seasons of Good Luck Charlie. I know that Teddy is not Charlie's mother. I know that. It's fake. I made it up. It's my original idea. And the first video that I posted said, Ever wondered what it would be like if Teddy was Charlie's mom? Here's what I imagine. Okay? It's supposed to be fake. Obviously. It's not that hard to wrap your brain around the fact that it's supposed to be fake. I don't understand how you can't understand that it's supposed to be fake. You don't have to point it out that it's fake. It's supposed to be fake. Anyways. I'm not going to go into that because it's what? What time is it? It is 7.53 p.m. So, not that late, but whatever. Um, second of all, I'm not a kid. I'm turning 19 in March. I was born on March 17th, 1998. So I'm turning 19. So I'm not a kid, okay? Just because someone can't spell doesn't mean they're a kid. I know lots of adults that just aren't good at spelling. And it's not that I'm not good at spelling because I am good at spelling. All of my friends ask me to spell is that I'm very bad at typing. I type very, very, very fast. And I have a habit of not looking over what I wrote before posting it. That's my problem. I'm very good at spelling. I'm just very bad at typing. That's just my problem. I'm not good at typing. I can spell. I'm just not very good at typing. And I don't look over what I wrote. I've always been like that. It's a bad habit of mine, I know. But I can spell. Seriously. I know that does is not spelled D-O-S-E. It's spelled D-O-E-S. I know that. I know how to spell breakfast. And I know how to spell half. H-A-L-F, it's just that when I type, I type really fast. So if I add an E at the end of half, it's just because I type really fast, I didn't look it over. So get over it. What else? Um... Yeah, this was like... Two years ago, like, I'm, I'm gonna look it up to see. I don't even remember when I posted these. Like, that's how long ago it was. I don't even remember. Like, cause I know I did a five season show after it called Good Luck Ty and Charlie. So I don't even remember when I posted the pregnancy parts. I'll just look it up on my laptop. I'm serious, you guys. Like, seriously. This was a long time ago that I posted these. So, like, get over it. If I see... If I'm watching a video and it was, like, posted two years ago, I'm not going to comment on it. If it's a stupid comment. If I'm watching something that has horrible spelling and I see that it was posted, like, two years ago, I'm not going to comment on it. It's just ridiculous to comment on something that was posted two years ago because chances are the person you created isn't even looking over comments for that specific video anymore. Okay, so... patient with me. Okay, maybe it'd be easier if I did uh, oldest to newest. Okay, so oh, I didn't remember half of these. Um, the first one was posted a year ago. And like almost two years ago. And the last pregnancy part was posted a year ago. So, like, get over it, people. If it's more than, like, let's say, 11 months ago, don't bother commenting. The comments don't hurt me. If you call me stupid or if you call me an idiot because I can't spell one little word, 
it doesn't hurt me. It's more of annoying than it hurts. It doesn't hurt me at all. I just find it really stupid. Amateur and annoying. You're calling me a kid, but here you are wasting your time about my spelling. How does it affect your life exactly if I can't spell one little word because I type too fast? Does it affect your life? So really, by wasting your time to comment on how my spelling is bad, you're just acting like a little, like a little brat. Like a little immature brat. Oh, I can't spell. Here, you want to see? Because I'm writing a book right now. So... I'm sorry about that noise, it's my fan, but... Do you see any spelling mistakes? Okay? Like, come on. Get over it. I'm really starting to get annoyed. If I get one more freaking comment, I'm, I swear to God, I'm enabling all comments. Oh, another thing. Some people are asking me why is this just not for kids. It's because I didn't want kids to watch this for a very simple reason. It's because I didn't want this to ruin their view of the actual show. I didn't want it to ruin the show for them. If I was a kid and I had seen something like this, every time I'd watch that show, all I could think about is what I saw in the video. Like, now when I watch Good Luck Charlie, which is not often because I kind of grew out of Good Luck Charlie. I mean, I'm an adult. But, like, if I'm watching it with my sister, who's nine, if I'm watching it with her, and all I can see is Teddy as Charlie's mom. I can't even see her as her sister anymore. It, it just completely ruined it for me, because now all I can see is how Teddy acted like a mom. I can't see anything else. All I can see is what I put in my videos. I just, it just ruined it for me. And now, I still like the show. Like, I watch it with my sister. But, I just... Now that I've made it, made that series with her as her mom, I can always pick out the little things that made her seem like a mom to Charlie. And I can't pick out anything that made her just look like a sister. So, and, you know, she did act kind of like a mom. I mean, I do too with my sister. I make videos for her. Like, I don't give her advice or anything, but I make home movies with her, and I babysit her all the time. So... But, and I do act like a mom, like I'll try to discipline her if she does something wrong, which I probably shouldn't do, but that's another story. I have to lock that out. Um, oh well, I guess it doesn't matter. Those are just family portraits on the wall, but I'm not sure if I should. Anyway, I just, I just wanted to clear those things up. So... My advice is to get over it and grow up yourselves. Because you're you're saying that I'm a little kid. Oh, um, before I go into that, one more thing. Um, there was one comment I it was posted a long time ago, but it was saying um, about how I messed up with the pregnancy, like when you should get the results. I know that you can't get the results a day after you find out your. Like, the day after you have sex. I know that. I know you have to wait at least a month. But I didn't mean to do that. I put week instead of month. It meant to say a month, okay? But I didn't mean to do it. And I did the same mistake later on in my series that I did with Good Luck Teddy and Charlie. I did it when she was pregnant with Toby. So, I know how pregnancy works. I took a parenting class. My stepmom is pregnant. Okay, so I know how pregnancy works. I'm not an idiot. I just made a mistake, and everyone makes mistakes. Now what was I saying? Oh, yes, you, you're telling me that I'm a little kid because I can't spell this little word or that or that because I made this series in the first place. But do you guys realize that you guys are acting like little kids? Seriously, if you have nothing better to do than to comment on how my spelling is when it really doesn't affect your life, then you really need to get a life and grow up. I don't go wasting my time commenting on someone's grammar or spelling. 
I always try to find the positives in the videos I watch. And if I can't find any positives, I leave and I watch something else. Because I'm not so immature that I bother wasting my time telling someone that they can't spell. There's really no point in telling me that because it doesn't affect your life. And even if you tell me I can't spell, it's not going to help me learn how to spell. And just pointing it out, I watch those videos too that I post. So don't you think I've noticed? I've noticed them. I've noticed the mistakes. Obviously, you don't have to point out that I'm not spelling things right. It's not going to affect your life. And by pointing it out, you look like you have way too much time on your hands. Just wanted to point that out. So it is now 8.03 p.m. And I have better things to do than waste my time trying to explain to you people when half of you probably won't watch this video and half of you probably will still think you still can't wrap your brain around the fact that it's supposed to be fake. I am not a child. End of story.